Hey guys, welcome back to New Kicks Cafe. It's all about them kicks and garnet. So, in this one, we're gonna look at the Nike. Um, it's Ear, or Ear Jordan 1 High um, Handcraft or uh, Retro High OG, whatever you wanna call it. And um, so the box is a little damaged because I had it in a suitcase or in a traveling bag or whatever you call it um so don't mind the lighting and the sound might not be very perfect because i'm in a hotel room uh so i picked this one up a couple days um maybe it's the latter part of december there i got it but i haven't got around to just doing it and um making a video because i i've been kind of just all over the place a bit um just getting some stuff done so I am just gonna unbox this one and I, I like the box itself. I like the fanciness of the box. Like I like how it looks almost like a st like these um, lines look like stitches, like some stitch like it's stitched onto the box and then you have the two-tone color like there's green, purple and then there's orange and then here you got a um, brown and the Nike swoosh on it. So all around you got the brown. And then to the line here, you got um, the orange. At the bottom, you have brown as well. And then on the front, you got the white, the orange, the purple, and the green. And I picked these up in Nike, so just a 10 and a half. So I just kind of kind of gets it. And I, I was particularly interested in this one because I because of the color. Uh, nothing, I don't think there's anything major in terms of the, um, what, um, extra from what a Jordan would actually looks like, right? So it comes with two laces. So there's a, a black lace and a pink or peach looking lace. Let's see. Yeah, I think it's peach. So I think the color on this is peach, unless I'm not seeing that very well. So, so they call this the handcraft, and I'm assuming it's not necessarily meaning handcraft, but I kind of think it's because of the the pattern that is on it. So it looks like it's um, different panels are added to it. So. You, to the front you got this nice brown almost like suede but it's leather and then on the top of it is the white to the side here you got white and then the black swoosh nike swoosh that goes all the way around it then to the back here you got the purple and on the trimming here to um that holds the tongue and the lace together you got green on both sides and then here you got a lighter shade of like mocha um, brown this one to the front look like mocha color and then a jean, um connecting the swoosh and the back itself you got this gray white panel gray white panel here and then you got at the back of it you got the black leather here and the jordan chris is almost like a nice vintage piece of um what would you call that like um uh the word is in my mouth i don't remember um, <laughs> um but it's a nice vintage piece of leather that they add to it so i mean it's a pretty nice shoes and then the tongue is basically black with the peach or pink whatever it looks like to you on the screen but it looks like peach from where i'm standing where i'm sitting so this is what this looks like um just give you a, a close-up of what it really looks like and i was excited and i'm excited about just trying these wearing them and see what it looks like and what it feels like and as you know i'm a fan of jordan one jordan mid and jordan lows i mean they're not necessarily super comfortable but they are pretty nice looking shoes and and you can style them however so so these look pretty dope so they're actually three pairs of uh, um at least so you got a white you got a black and then you also have the peach so that works all right 
and I mean these looks pretty premium it doesn't I mean at least my pair looks um, premium it looks like some effort goes into it um, nothing out of the ordinary um, all the threads are neatly trimmed and the stitches and I like I, and I, I guess that's why they consider it craft because I like the exposed thread everywhere like there's exposed thread everywhere you look like nice white exposed thread I like that so that's cool um, nothing special uh, in terms of the inside oh nice the sole of it looks almost like pretty padded like the back itself like, I don't know if you can see that like pattern nicely pattern all right so I'm gonna try them and then let you see what it looks like okay and then get back to you all right guys so um, this has been the Air Jordan 1 high um, craft or OG um, whatever you want to call it um, handcrafted I think that's what they call it or some people just call it craft whatever um, I mean they are pretty sweet in terms of how they look on the feet I don't know what you thought what's your thought and what you saw but um, from where I'm standing I thought it looks pretty slick it um, the whole thing looks um, pretty nice um, sorry if there's any background noise um, as I said before it's a hotel so things are happening um, but I did I enjoy these I, I think I would be enjoy wearing these I like the color blocking I like all of that I don't think I cared that much about the lace because I remember I said there was three lace black white and a peach but it's um, it's a two color lace so you have black at the bottom here and then the peach at the top or pink whatever the color, whatever the color is um, so but I, I I think I'm I think I'm not hating these um, I don't care too much about the this color I think they maybe could have used that maybe maybe the purple I think it would have looked better and our um, the green here that green or the purple here and then also just move this and put maybe the purple there or the green I think I think that's just my my thought on it but I think overall the shoes is pretty nice it is like quality standard um, the finish is very um, yeah the finish is very very high quality standard it's quality finish so I, I like that because sometimes you you get these and the quality control of it is not that sure it's not that great 
but these are pretty um, great. I, I, I love these. I, I just love these. And I was just thinking um, earlier when I was trying to figure a word, it's like patch. You know, you can buy a patch and put it on. So the Jordan Crest is like a, a very vintage, nice brown leather patch. So that's um, pretty cool. So, so that's it for me, from me with this one. Um, so I got some excited um, content coming up. I'm doing a collab with somebody here. And so we're just kind of meeting up and just kind of do some stuff. He has a channel on, so um, when we get to that, I think after this, those couple videos, maybe two or three videos after this will be with that person. And so I hope you guys will love that. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Please remember um, to like, comment and subscribe. And I appreciate the fact that um, you guys stick with me throughout um, 2021. It's 2022 and I just want to verbally um, say to everyone that I wish for all of all of us and um, and everyone that's watch that will watch this now and later on that you have a good year um, that the year will be healthy that it will be fulfilling that all the, the the dreams and the hopes that you have for life and for um, a quality life will be fulfilled in that sense. All right, and I wish you all the success and all the best. I um, appreciate you guys continue to support. Remember, again, please like, comment, and subscribe as usual. All right, and as always, stay inspired, and I see you or catch you in the next one. Bye.